Number one consumer of water in the world is agriculture. Israeli innovation is helping today farmers all over the world to grow more with less. We are uh, developing a new technology that uh, enables us to use the water in a greater efficiency. Projections of water needs tell us that we may need almost to double our water and mainly to double it for food production. Our research in cooperation with our farmers came to different solutions, developing new agro techniques which allows farmers to produce much better per unit area with less water. In 1965, we were a group of young farmers in the Israeli Negev desert in Kibbutz Hatzerim, and we faced the challenge of water scarcity and very poor soil. And we were farmers. We were looking for a solution. The idea of drip irrigation, this innovation, is delivering water and nutrients, by the way. Sometimes we call it nutrigation, delivering it at the right amount directly to the roots where it's needed and when it's needed. Plants lose most of the water they take from the ground to the atmosphere. They lose the water to millions of tiny little pores that exist on the surface of the leaves. We discovered a new mechanism that controls these tiny little pores. Here, for example, we have two plants. The plant with our technology lose less water and it grows faster. We are uh, developing a new technology that uh, enables us to use the water in a greater efficiency. We use uh, the temperature of the leaves, a thermal camera, to uh, make an index that can tell us how much water the trees need. We can uh, produce olive oil, which is much better when we irrigate according to the parameters that we give to the farmers. Israel is leading in being efficient in water for agriculture and especially for crop production. By doing so, we managed to be about six, seven times more efficient in water use as we were about 50 years ago. And therefore, we can allocate the saved water that was needed for agriculture to other resources. <music>